Prime Minister Brigadier Retired Mark Phillips said when operational, the new solar farm in Barctica would reduce fuel costs. On Tuesday, the Prime Minister visited the ongoing construction works where he noted that it will also aid in the transition of fossil fuel to greater use of renewable energy, reducing Guyana's carbon footprint. The Prime Minister is optimistic that the solar farm, which is in keeping with the government's Low Carbon Development Strategy LCDS 2030, will aid in the overall development of the town. It will also help in terms of the expansion of business in this community because you have additional energy, right? It now becomes more attractive for investors to set up, you know, micro and, you know, little, little larger um, industries and commercial activities in Bartico. The Prime Minister expressed satisfaction with the progress of the 1.5 megawatt solar farm, which is currently 90% completed. We are satisfied based on the briefing we received. This project is on schedule and it's expected to be handed over to the government of Guyana by the 1st of June this year. Um, and we see no reason why it will not be concluded and handed over to the government again by the force of June. The solar farm, which will be connected to the Guyana Power and Light Grid in Bartica, will reduce the cost of producing energy. Prime Minister Phillips also applauded the fact that 95% of the workers are Guyanese.